Ma'am, uh, you are the Disability Director of WHO and now uh, the conference WCNR 2018 was basically on disability and neuro rehabilitation. So what is your take on the conference and uh, what is your vision about disability? So in, uh, in terms of the conference, it was a great conference, at least what I have seen. Um, I have been here for 24 hours. It was tremendously well organized. So you have done a wonderful job. The whole team behind the conference had done a wonderful uh, job. It has been also very high quality papers. And um, I think that is important in the field of rehabilitation to really dis have the community to discuss what are the effective interventions um, that exist uh, nowadays. Uh, for treating uh, patients that have um, problems in the field of, neuro, uh, of, of neurology or neurological problems. So in terms of my role at WHO, I'm responsible for, indeed in the context of this, uh, of this conference, important to mention that I'm the person responsible for rehabilitation at the World Health um, Organization. And um, what we want to promote at WHO is the agenda of rehabilitation integrated in, um, in health services and as part of people-centered care and being recognized and promoted as a health strategy within universal health coverage. That is the reason why WHO is working to in our priority package of rehabilitation interventions to be able to work, support countries, to give technical support when they embark into the process of including rehabilitation um, in uh, universal health coverage. That will benefit many, many people with uh, disabilities, but will also benefit the whole population because people with disabilities need rehabilitation but also many other people um, that perhaps will not, are not disabled or will not become disabled but have an acute condition like for example an accident or have a an stroke and then they need rehabilitation to recuperate. So rehabilitation needs to be seen at mainstream services that needs to be available for persons with disabilities and for the public, for the whole population as a whole, because all of us will benefit at some point of our lives for, of rehabilitation services. There are a number of experts, including Dr. Nirmal Surya, stressed upon uh, uh, low-cost uh, rehabilitation, uh, especially in Asia and Africa. As WHO uh, very senior functionary, what is your take on low-cost rehabilitation? I think um, what, if, if it's in many, in many uh, settings, is, uh, these are the services that can be provided, I think, um, and should be provided. And uh, what we need is also more research um, in order to prove the effectiveness of low-cost rehabilitation, and also research about how we can scale up rehabilitation services that are low cost because if we can demonstrate that it's effective and can be scaled up many different countries and many different areas in countries that are low resource will benefit from it and countries learn from each other and that is the reason why we need these case examples of, um, of um, low uh, cost of rehabilitation that is effective and can be scaled up.